Welcome to a new video of Masters Academy CET 2020 Mathematics Topic Inverse Trigonometric Functions Synopsis and Problems Prepared by N. Parmesh Synopsis First point Domains and range of inverse trigonometric functions First one y is equal to sin inverse x domain closed interval minus 1 comma 1 range closed interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 second one y is equal to cos inverse x domain closed interval minus 1 comma plus 1 range closed interval 0 comma pi third one y is equal to tan inverse x domain x belongs to set of real number range open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2. fourth one y is equal to cosecant inverse x domain mod x greater than or equal to 1 range open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 except y is not equal to 0 fifth one y is equal to secant inverse x domain mod x greater than or equal to 1 range closed interval 0 comma pi except y is not equal to pi by 2 sixth one y is equal to cot inverse x domain x belongs to set of real number range open interval 0 comma pi Second point, sin inverse of minus x is equal to minus sin inverse x. Cos inverse of minus x is equal to pi minus cos inverse x. Tan inverse of minus x is equal to minus tan inverse x. Cot inverse of minus x is equal to pi minus cot inverse x. Third one, sin inverse x plus cos inverse x is equal to pi by 2. Tan inverse x plus cot inverse x is equal to pi by 2. Secant inverse x plus cosecant inverse x is equal to pi by 2. Fourth point, tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus xy. If x is greater than or equal to 0, comma y is greater than or equal to 0, but x ka x into y less than 1. Second one, in that b, tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to pi plus tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus xy condition x greater than or equal to 0 comma y greater than or equal to 0 but xy is greater than 1 c tan inverse x minus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse of x minus y divided by 1 plus xy condition x greater than or equal to 0 comma y greater than or equal to 0 comma x into y greater than minus 1 d tan inverse x plus tan inverse y plus tan inverse z is equal to tan inverse of x plus y plus z minus x y z divided by 1 minus x y minus y z minus z x where x comma y comma z always greater than or equal to 0 e tan inverse of 1 plus x divided by 1 minus x is equal to tan inverse 1 plus tan inverse x f tan inverse of 1 minus x divided by 1 plus x is equal to tan inverse 1 minus tan inverse x. Fifth point a 2 sin inverse x is equal to sin inverse of 2x into root 1 minus x square. b second b point 2 cos inverse x is equal to cos inverse of 2x square minus 1. c 2 tan inverse x is equal to tan inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square that is also equal to sin inverse of 2x divided by 1 plus x square that is also equal to cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square. Sixth a point 3 sin inverse x is equal to sin inverse of 3x minus 4x cube. b 3 cos inverse x is equal to cos inverse of 4x cube minus 3x. C. 3 tan inverse x is equal to tan inverse of 3x minus x cube divided by 1 minus 3x square. Eighth point. In that star points. First one. If tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to pi by 4, then the value of x plus y plus xy is equal to 1. Second point. 
if tan inverse x plus tan inverse y plus tan inverse z is equal to pi by 2 then x y plus y z plus z x is equal to 1. Third point if tan inverse x plus tan inverse y plus tan inverse z is equal to pi then x plus y plus z is equal to x into y into z. Fourth point if sin inverse x plus sin inverse y plus sin inverse z is equal to pi by 2 then x square plus y square plus z square plus 2 x y z is equal to 1. Fifth point if sin inverse x plus sin inverse y plus sin inverse z is equal to pi then x into root 1 minus x square plus y into root 1 minus y square plus z into root 1 minus z square is equal to 2 into x into y into z. Sixth point if sin inverse x plus sin inverse y plus sin inverse z is equal to 3 pi by 2 then the value of x into y plus y into z plus z into x is equal to 3. Seventh point if cos inverse x plus cos inverse y plus cos inverse z is equal to pi then the value of x square plus y square plus z square plus 2 x y z is equal to 1. Eighth point if cos inverse x plus cos inverse y plus cos inverse z is equal to 3 pi then x into y plus y into z plus z into x is equal to 3. Ninth point if sin inverse x plus sin inverse y is equal to pi by 2 then x square plus y square is equal to 1. Next ninth point tan inverse of x by y minus tan inverse of x minus y divided by x plus y is equal to pi by 4. Tenth point the value of tan inverse 2 plus tan inverse 3 is equal to 3 pi by 4. Eleventh point the value of tan inverse 1 plus tan inverse 2 plus tan inverse 3 is equal to pi. Twelfth point the value of tan inverse 1 plus tan inverse 1 by 2 plus tan inverse 1 by 3 plus so on is equal to pi by 2. Thirteenth point tan inverse of a plus bx divided by b minus ax is equal to tan inverse of a by b plus tan inverse x where x is less than b by a. Fourteen point sigma summation tan inverse of a minus b divided by 1 plus ab is always equal to 0. Fifteen point if tan inverse of x plus 1 divided by x plus 2 plus tan inverse of x minus 1 divided by x minus 2 is equal to pi by 4 then the value of x is equal to plus or minus 1 by root 2. Sixteen point if cos inverse x plus cos inverse y is equal to pi by 2 then the value of x square plus y square is equal to 1. Seventeenth point if tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to pi by 2 comma then the value of x into y is equal to 1. Eighteenth point if sin inverse of 2a divided by 1 plus a square plus sin inverse of 2b divided by 1 plus b square is equal to 2 tan inverse x then the value of x is equal to a plus b divided by 1 minus a b. Nineteenth point if tan inverse of root 1 plus x square minus root 1 minus x square divided by root 1 plus x square plus root 1 minus x square is equal to alpha then the value of x square is equal to sin 2 alpha. Twentieth point tan inverse of root 1 plus x minus root 1 minus x divided by root 1 plus x plus root 1 minus x is equal to pi by 4 minus 1 by 2 cos inverse x. 21st point cot inverse of root 1 plus sin x plus root 1 minus sin x divided by root 1 plus sin x minus root 1 minus sin x is equal to x by 2. 22nd point tan inverse of root 1 plus cos x plus root 1 minus cos x divided by root 1 plus cos x minus root 1 minus cos x is equal to pi by 4 minus x by 2. Next first question the value of tan inverse x minus cot inverse x is equal to tan inverse 1 by root 3 has four options are given answer tan inverse x as it is minus cot inverse x is nothing but pi by 2 minus tan inverse x is equal to pi by 6. 1 tan inverse x plus 1 tan inverse x is 2 tan inverse x is equal to minus pi by 2 shifted to other side plus pi by 2 plus pi by 6. 2 tan inverse x is equal to by taking 6 as an LCM 3 pi plus 1 pi 4 pi by 6. Tan inverse x is equal to 4 pi divided by 12. 
Therefore, tan inverse x is equal to pi by 3, which implies x is equal to root 3. There is only one value of x. Therefore, there is unique solution. Therefore, option second one is the right answer. Second question. The domain of the function defined by f of x is equal to sin inverse root x minus 1 is. Four options are given. Answer. Domain of sin inverse is closed interval minus 1 to plus 1. That is minus 1 less than or equal to root x minus 1 less than or equal to 1. But root x minus 1 is always greater than or equal to 0. Therefore, 0 less than or equal to root x minus 1 less than or equal to 1. Squaring on both sides, 0 square is 0 less than or equal to root x minus 1 whole square is x minus 1 less than or equal to 1. Adding 1 to each term, 1 less than or equal to x minus 1 plus 1 is x less than or equal to 1 plus 1 2. Therefore, 1 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 2 that is closed interval 1 comma 2 that is there in option first one is the right answer. Third question if tan inverse of root 1 plus x square minus 1 divided by x is equal to 8 then the value of x is equal to 4 options are given. Answer tan inverse root 1 plus x square minus 1 divided by x is always equal to 1 by 2 tan inverse x. Substitute that value in the given problem that is 1 by 2 tan inverse x is equal to 8. Therefore, 1 by 2 tan inverse x is equal to 8. Therefore, tan inverse x is equal to cross multiplication 8 to the 16. Tan inverse x is equal to 16 which implies x is equal to tan 16 that is there in option third one is the right answer. Fourth question the domain of y is equal to cos inverse of x square minus 4 is four options are given answer the domain of cos inverse is once again lies between minus 1 to plus 1 closed interval minus 1 to plus 1 minus 1 less than or equal to x square minus 4 less than or equal to 1 adding 4 to each term plus 4 minus 1 is 3 x square minus 4 plus 4 is x square less than or equal to 1 plus 4 is 5 which implies 3 less than or equal to x square less than or equal to 5 x, x is plus or minus root 3 plus or minus root 5 plus or minus root 3 less than or equal to x less than or equal to plus or minus root 5. Therefore, x belongs to closed interval minus root 5 comma minus root 3 union closed interval root 3 comma root 5 that is there in option fourth one is the right answer. Fifth question 2 tan inverse of minus 3 is equal to 4 options are given answer tan inverse of minus x is nothing but minus tan inverse x 2 as it is tan inverse of minus 3 that is equal to 2 as it is tan inverse of minus 3 is nothing but minus tan inverse 3 therefore 2 tan inverse of minus 3 is equal to minus 2 tan inverse 3 that is equal to minus as it is the value of uh, tan is 3 Therefore, 2 tan inverse x formula pi plus tan inverse 2x divided by 1 minus x square that is equal to minus of pi plus tan inverse 2 into x is 3 divided by 1 minus 3 square is 9 that is equal to minus of pi as it is 1 minus 9 is minus 8 6 divided by minus 8 2 3 za to 4 za that is 3 by 4 minus 3 by 4 that is equal to minus of pi minus tan inverse 3 by 4 that is equal to multiplied by minus minus pi minus into minus plus tan inverse 3 by 4 that is equal to minus pi plus tan inverse 3 by 4 is also equal to cos inverse 4 by 5 that is there in option second one is the right answer sixth question if cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square plus tan inverse x is equal to pi by 2 then x is equal to four options are given answer cos inverse of 1 minus x square divided by 1 plus x square is equal to 2 tan inverse x substitute in the given problem 2 tan inverse x plus tan inverse x is equal to pi by 2 2 tan inverse x plus 1 tan inverse x is 3 tan inverse x is equal to pi by 2 tan inverse x is equal to pi by 6 3 3 to the 6 therefore x is equal to tan pi by 6 that is equal to 1 by root 3 that is there in option third one is the right answer seventh one the value of sine 
of two cos inverse root 5 by 3 is four options are given answer first treat cos inverse of root 5 by 3 is equal to alpha therefore cos alpha is equal to 5 by root 3 automatically which implies sin alpha is equal to 2 by 3 sin 2 alpha is equal to 2 sin alpha cos alpha that is equal to 2 sin alpha is 2 by 3 into cos alpha is root 5 by 3 2 2 is a 4 root 5 divided by 3 3 is a 9 that is there in option first one is the right answer eighth question the value of sine of 2 sine inverse 0 0.8 is equal to four options are given answer sine of 2 sine inverse 0 0.8 is nothing but 8 divided by 10 2 4 are 2 5 za sine of 2 sine inverse 4 by 5 first uh, treat uh, sine inverse 4 by 5 is equal to theta sine theta is equal to 4 by 5 which implies cos theta is equal to 3 by 5 sine 2 theta is equal to 2 sine theta cos theta that is equal to 2 sine theta is 4 by 5 into cos theta is 3 by 5 that is equal to 4 3 is a 12 12 2 is a 24 divided by 25 that is equal to 24 divided by 25 is equal to 0 0.96 that is there in option fourth one is the right answer ninth question if sin of sin inverse 1 by 5 plus cos inverse x is equal to 1 then x is equal to 4 options are given answer sin inverse 1 by 5 plus cos inverse x is equal to sin inverse 1 which implies sin inverse 1 by 5 plus cos inverse x is equal to sin inverse 1 is nothing but pi by 2 sin inverse x plus cos inverse x is equal to pi by 2 therefore the value of x is equal to 1 by 5 that is there in option third one is the right answer tenth question last question if sin inverse of 2p divided by 1 plus p square minus cos inverse of 1 minus q square divided by 1 plus q square is equal to tan inverse of 2x divided by 1 minus x square then the value of x is equal to 4 options are given answer left hand side sin inverse 2p divided by 1 plus p square is nothing but 2 tan inverse p cos inverse 1 minus q square divided by 1 plus q square is nothing but 2 tan inverse q therefore lhs is equal to 2 tan inverse p minus 2 tan inverse q by taking 2 as common tan inverse p minus tan inverse q that is equal to 2 tan inverse p minus q divided by 1 plus p q right hand side tan inverse 2x divided by 1 minus x square is nothing but 2 tan inverse x while comparing left hand side and right hand side the value of x is equal to p minus q divided by 1 plus p q therefore the value of x is equal to p minus q divided by 1 plus p pq that is there in option fourth one is the right answer dear friends if you find this video useful then please subscribe our channel and share it to your friends thank you